Thank you so much. I want to see you at Mweku Day's hut. In three days. Mweku Day's hut? Yes. Haven't you heard of uh, First Nolly TV? Home of Nollywood movies. Mm -hmm. Subscribe now. First Nolly TV. Go talk back. Strange human in the street. <laughs> he just appeared from nowhere and everybody's running for their lives. Strange human? Yes. Man or woman? I don't know. We just left the stream. <laughs> we are running for our lives. You better go back to your father's house. Just go back to your father's house. <laughs> Hey, 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 good, I'm going. Oh, where are you going? I'm back. Where are you going to? Hey. Didn't you hear what they said? They said there's a strange human in the stream. Eh? Let us go. So we will not have water in our homes. Because a strange being appeared, we'll fetch the water tomorrow. For now, let's go. This spirit can be something else, so. Unless you want to get initiated, Tifiakwa. That is being an Ogbanje. Or is Ogbanje not in connection with water spirits? If not for one thing, I should have insisted that we we'll go and see for ourselves. Mm -hmm. Because this uh, spirit might be friendly. So let's go. I wonder how a strange being will kill people just like that. Mm -hmm. Let's go and see for ourselves. That's if we will still see it. If we don't, we'll fetch water and we'll leave. Hey. Let's wow, go. will come.
These are what both of you have. Others saw me and ran away. But both of you, both of you came to see for yourselves. No, she was the one that said we should come and see for ourselves. Hey, where are you go? Hmm. Why are you lying? Are you not the person that said we should come? Hmm. That whoever the strange human is will not harm us is a lie. Please, eh? We are sorry. Continue with what you are doing. Don't be in a hurry. I told you I love your gods. Don't you want to be friends with me? We, we will. I, I like you. Me too. It seems you're a strange human. Like they said. But you act like a normal person. I am a normal person. Forget about what people are saying. My name is Azoka Ego. Are you from this our community? Yes. Yes, I am from this community. We are friends, right? Come and fetch your water. We will see you again. Please don't harm us, eh? Please. We just want to fetch water and go. What are you doing here all alone? Come with us. Not to worry. Someone is coming with my pots. I'll see you in the village. Bye. our stream or you went somewhere else from our stream hey but i had all the people that went to the stream they all ran back home and said they saw a strange human in the stream didn't you see the strange person we got to the stream mm -hmm. we fetched water mm -hmm. all we saw was a human being or are we dead the water we are carrying we fetched it from our stream does it mean they lied i don't know you can go and check for yourself oh go. Yeah. let's go
Azukego, are you really human? The other day you vanished into thin air, and now you are here. Nobody lives here, Azukego. This place is prohibited for anyone to enter or stay. I, are you hearing me? Please, my dear friend. I am not in a good mood. I do not want to talk. Azukego, we met at the stream and we became friends. You have been exhibiting some kind of mystic behavior. But I am not afraid of you. With the hope that, as your friend, you will tell me who you are. So I ask you, my friend, are you human? Like I said earlier, I do not want to talk. When next we see, I will answer all your questions. But for now, I want to be left alone. Do you want food? 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 What type of food? <sighs> Any kind of food you want. My father is a known farmer in this community. So whatever you want, just mention it. I'll get it for you. I would love roasted yam. And Obaka. All bean. Very well then. I'll go and prepare it for you. But please, when I come back, you will tell me who you are.
there was an order from the king that no one should be seen around this hut. And if seen by the elders, you will be fined. I wonder what you are doing here. I do not know what you are talking about. Besides, did anyone see me when the orders were made? It's not a matter of whether you were seen or not. It was an order from the king. See, I would advise you to leave the hut because there was a certain old woman that lived here before and was, uh... <sighs> Never mind. Come. Who are you? He just appeared from nowhere to this village. Singing and dancing so well. Your beauty is just like a morning sunrise, sparkling like the stars. Who are you? My name is Azoka Ego. Azoka Ego. I am your sister. Sister, Azuka. She says she's hungry, so I prepared this yam for her. <laughs> Where did you see her? <clears throat> you won't believe it. I saw her at Mbeke Ude's heart. Eh? Yes. Mbeke Ude's heart? Yes. What is she doing there? I don't know. I saw her sitting all alone. I asked her some few questions, but she said she was not in the mood to talk. But when I asked her if she's hungry, she said yes. Hey! Ah, ah. You know what? I have to go with you. That girl has not told us who she really is. So let's go. Mm -hmm. Let's go now. Where could this go? But she was here a few hours ago when she told me she was hungry. I'm getting more confused. Could she have come from the world beyond? How do you mean? Can't you see the way she's appearing and disappearing at will? A few hours ago, she was sitting right there. Mm -hmm. This place we all know is forbidden for every human in this community. I think she's a human with a lot of mystic powers. But very soon, we shall know who she is. Eh? You're good. Let's go home and eat this food. Eh? Azuke Ego is not hungry. Let's go. Azuke Ego. She's not hungry. Let's go.
Igwe. This is not ordinary. The evil ones are behind this. From what I am seeing, the prince cannot walk again. Hello. The bones have been eaten up. He will be alive and healthy. Just the issue of walking. Impossible. Yeah. Very, very impossible. How do he ascend the throne of his forefathers? Where he cannot walk. Oh. Oh. Whoever is behind this. Whoever is behind this will suffer. No. Let, let us not cry like people without hope. Prince GK is still alive. He can get a wife and still be a children as quickly as possible. So you can have your throne back. <laughs> Whoever did this knows that a cripple or a blind man will not be crowned a king in Ogu Kingdom. <laughs> they have finished me! Whoever did this to me, what did I do to you? <laughs> Life and healthy. All we need to do is to make plans as regards to what the native doctor said. It's okay. Uh, <laughs> Ophia, see me in my chambers. You take me inside. Uh, Ophia, tell me what do I do? My son, who is to succeed me, is out of the way. And this is the throne of my forefathers. I do not want to be the one to end it. How could my son, who is physically fit, all of a sudden develop a strange disease that he can no longer walk? I will advise you call a meeting of your cabinet and discuss this with them before knowing what to do finally. Do you think it is a better solution? Because at this stance now, I do not know who is after me or who is after my son. Let's see after the meeting. But I will still insist on making arrangements for your wife before it will be too late. Oh, that is your mother. I will be on my way. What troubles the heart of my father? Oh, my man. It is said that an ego does not lay egg on the ground. But on the tallest of the trees, where no human eyes can see it. Reason, greed, and unnecessary troubles of life. Father, you are right. The eagle and the highest tree we are created by the gods. And he that created has the power to take. Even the eagle does not have the power of procreation, but the gods have. All I am saying is that we must allow the gods to take charge. Ejike is not dead. But he is of no use to me or to the throne. Father, this is the only aspect of your life that I do not like. You lose hope so easily. And it's not good. You are not dying, neither is AGK. So let us get on with the plan and forget all these evil planners. I tell you. You can now go. No, Father. Not until you follow me, because your food is ready. 
Uh, I know my daughter. Your precious daughter. Uh, you can go, I'll, I'll, I'll join you soon. No, 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 no. We must go together. Mm. Yes, father. God! My majesty, go to all my cabinet chiefs. Tell them I want to see them here and it is urgent. It's all right. Greetings, Iche. I was going to your house. I hope all is well. All is well. Igwe said I should call all his cabinet member. I think something came up. Uh, uh, all right, I will be there. Uh, meanwhile, go to Iche Okungu's house. I just left his house now, so you can tell him to. All right. Greetings. You're welcome. Greetings. Is Chief Deka at home? Um, I have not seen him, but uh, I'm sure he'll be in his hut. You said you are looking for my father. Yes. The next time you come here, don't ask anyone you see about my father. So, Majesty, for my father is not their biological father. Oh no, my let thunder strike that your mouth. Oh, mama, let thunder, eh? Strike that your mouth. See, let me tell you, when the time comes, eh, we will know the true daughter of Udenka. You, um, please, if the chair returns, tell him that you will want to see him at the palace. Um, okay. no problem. Uh, oh, mama. Why were you raising your voice, Papa? I was just telling the king's guard who to ask of you. In case of next time, so that you shouldn't make the mistake of asking some idiots that don't know their father. Eh? Papa, 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 have you heard that? Okay, go, okay, go. Sit down. Continue with your work. Look at your running mouth. Mama, have I not warned you to stop talking to your elder sister? Anyhow, she is my first seed. And whatever you and your mother have against her, it's not my concern. And the fact will never work. Papa, thank you for saying that again. Thank you for saying that again. Hey! I have warned Unoma and my mother to stop carrying Makego's name all over this community. Everybody should mind his or her business. Everybody should mind his or her business. Um. Please. Tell the Igwe that I will be with him at his palace. Very, very soon. Yes, it's you. Are. Ulama, you must be very careful in this. Ula! I love you, Ulama. Uh, uh, 
This issue has been troubling me. Because the prince we are talking about was not born paralyzed. He suddenly developed it. Uh, let me ask you this question. Could it mean that uh, the gods are angry with something or something is angry with the gods? Are you directing this question to the gods or to me? Ah, the, the gods are not here. We are two now. Mbaka, <laughs> whatever be the reason, is not my concern. My concern is a paralyzed man cannot rule us. No way. That's my concern. Uh, that, that is a good one. Uh, but I want us to go to the palace. Yes. And find out why the king summoned us. Look at you. You have the ghost talk about your useless mother who ran after a man that has family. I should be the one asking Papa if he actually impregnated your mother before she gave birth to you. My father said your mother was pregnant before he unknowingly married her. And you are here claiming first daughter. Hold on. Has Papa not warned you to stop saying that I'm not your sister? Your mother is a witch. Yes. All her plans towards me is fruitless. Soon, she will explain to my mother's brothers how my mother ate poison and died. You will soon eat the poison, oh? Yes! You will soon eat your own poison, since you are becoming an issue for me and my mother. Hey! I said it! Both of you cannot kill me. You cannot poison me, oh, in this house. Never. This is my father's house. You cannot poison me. Let me tell you something. Haven't you been trying? You and your mother have been trying to kill me. Haven't you? You know... Because I'm bigger than two of you. Come on, get out of my sight. And if I don't... I know what to do. Over my dead body. Over my dead body will I accept you as my sister. Come and carry your load and leave this house. I am very sure my father that you're not my father's child. Come and carry your load and leave this house. Look at you. I know you will sit at home and watch your sister insult Mwakwego. Yes. This life is a journey. But as we join in, we must be very careful. Because no one knows his or our end. The manner at which Norma is talking and insulting her elder sister is not good. You must talk to her. Ibe, do you know I just left home now to check my trap? Just now! Oh, maybe my father and I left and as women they sat to exchange words. How? I don't understand. Ibe, he was sent one of his guards to call my father, and there was an issue. Though my father warned Onoma. Don't worry, me. Let me get home first. You better talk to her. You better talk to her before you Haven't you heard of her? First Nollywood TV, home of Nollywood movies. Subscribe now. First Nollywood TV. Don't touch that.